Hello, my angels. Hello, my baby. Come on then. Oh, just started. And he wanted to come up. Say hello to everybody. Hi, are you looking out the window? He loves this position. Anyway, <laughs> hello my angels. I hope you're all really, really well and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I also just wanna say welcome to lots of new faces. I've noticed a few new subscribers, so welcome to the YouTube channel. Wiggy, say hello to everybody. Can we give everybody a little bit of a wave? Yeah? <laughs> well, it has been a remarkably busy day. I can't even begin to tell you. I feel like I have not actually looked up today. And why are you not focusing? There we go. Uh, just email after email. Fighting fires at the moment, but all is good. I shouldn't complain. We have so much coming up and I'm actually off to Mallorca tomorrow morning. I am so excited to see some sunshine and to see my parents. My whole family are flying to Mallorca for Easter. And we are going to be having just the most special, wholesome family time all together. And of course, I will be taking you with me. But I kind of have a little bit of a routine before I get on a plane. And obviously, to be honest with you, it's just been a mental day and I feel like I'm a little bit backed up. I still need to pack. And something always what I do um, before I get on a plane is to make sure that my body, I move it. I have movement, my blood is circulating, I feel healthy, I feel vital. And so I have come down to the gym with the hope <laughs> that I will do a workout. So this vlog, we are going to be going to Mallorca together. We're going to be prepping. I have a little bit of a routine before I get onto any flight. We're gonna be packing together and we are going to the sunshine together. I cannot wait. It is going to be absolutely glorious. And we are going to be spending Easter with my family, my whole family, are flying out and it's just going to be the most gorgeous wholesome beautiful time and um, I just can't wait and I'm so looking forward to sharing it with you you guys seem to love my gosh do you hear those birds singing <laughs> you all seem to love my Mallorcan content so I'm really looking forward to sharing it with you of course but before we get there I have a little bit of a routine that I love to do before I get on a plane and it's something I I'm sort of it's become like sacrosanct for me and that is to move my body before I get on a plane now for those of you who have subscribed to my YouTube channel for quite some time will know that I've been on a bit of a health and fitness regime I set myself some goals and some targets at the beginning of the year and I'm really proud of myself to say that I've stuck to them but I've been trialing a fitness app for quite some time now and I wanted to try it out first obviously before talking to you about it and I am honestly so thrilled and genuinely over the moon that we have actually partnered together to, to bring you this vlog. So, I think, well, so many of you have mentioned in the comments down below that I'm looking really strong and healthy and I don't really tend to like to talk about weight loss, but I also want to be honest with you guys, that was one of my goals, but also to be lean and strong and fit and to be able to run and and basically have something that was specifically tailored to me. So I have been trialing something called Copilot Fitness. And basically it's an app, but what makes Copilot different is the human interaction, the human touch, and quite honestly, 
the personalization and just the depth that it goes into to be fully bespoke to you and that is what i love the most and i read so much about the brand and about the app and about the experience and quite honestly the testimonials because all of it was just remarkable but with anything like me i want to try it myself and i want to have the experience and you know, make my own opinion of it. And I was looking for something that was really specifically tailored to me and to my body to understand, you know, different elements. I've had shoulder surgery. I've done lots of different things to my body, obviously from my show jumping career. I have a very bad ankle, you know, I suffer from migraines. I'm quite weak in some areas and really strong in others. And I just wanted to have somebody that first of all understood all of that, second of all had the experience to be able to give me professional and knowledgeable expertise and to achieve the goals, to achieve my goals that I really, really wanted to achieve. And don't get me wrong, I haven't yet achieved them, but I'm most certainly closer to hitting that goal. I'm wobbling on, and I feel like I'm not really giving you guys a very good explanation, but Copilot are a very, very unique fitness experience that is brought to you by an app. And it is so tailored to your specifications and your unique admirations of yourself and you are assigned your very own personal trainer and for those of you who have subscribed to my channel you'll know that I am here there and absolutely everywhere I am on the road I'm at events I'm in the UK I'm in Mallorca I'm traveling constantly and it's almost twofold in a way because one <laughs> I'm not at the level where I can, you know, fly my personal trainer around the world, but to have my personal trainer there at any point on 24 hour live chat, just sending her little messages within the app is just incredible. If I have any questions, if I'm feeling, you know, maybe off that day, maybe I've got a terrible migraine, maybe I've started my period, you know, <laughs> during my Easter extravaganza, I took a bit of a toss and really hurt my elbow and the back of my head. And you know what? I took a couple of days off, but my personal trainer was there to support me, there to deliver a workout where one, I just don't have to worry about it or think about it. That's half of my stress when it comes to a workout that actually puts me off in a way because I have so much to think about in my work life and my personal life and you know, my life that to then think about a workout, what am I gonna do today? to have it on the co-pilot fitness app there ready and waiting for me has been a godsend it has almost ensured that i've done the workout and another thing that probably chris does not want me to say is that kind of knowing that she's there and that she's going to check up on me makes sure that i am doing the workout and really holds me accountable so I feel like I keep saying Chris, so to introduce you to my trainer, all of you will get your own assigned trainer. You will build a really, really wonderful rapport and wonderful relationship with them where they will get to know you, what you want to achieve, your body, any sort of niggles you might have, maybe past injuries and... Um, She's just incredible and I've really, really enjoyed actually getting to know her and sending little messages sort of saying, oh my goodness me, my workout was really tough tonight, but I can feel it and actually I can see it. And not only can I see it, you guys have all been commenting on my fitness and wellness journey and I'm absolutely loving it. I am almost addicted. And to actually just talk you through the app because it's something that I was a little bit apprehensive about at the beginning. I was saying, you know, an app, like, is it easy to use? Is it going to be easy for like my mother to use? I think it's such an incredible concept, but it's got to be brilliant. It's got to be easy. It's got to be quick. It's got to be slick and it's got to be personalized. It truly ticks every single box. And you all know me, I do not work with a brand or endorse a product or even wear a product 
if I don't love it and genuinely use it on a daily basis. And I feel like with this, it's just that extra step further that you can actually see the results. Now, I think with everything that goes on in the world with, you know, maybe eating disorders and things like that, and I'm very, very conscious that I have um, young, impressionable ladies and gentlemen on here. And I think when you're talking about weight and specific numbers, I think that's a really, really dangerous place to be. And I just want to really, really harp on about being the best healthiest and fittest version of myself. I want to look strong and that's what I that's what I was aiming to do. So I'm gonna stop banging on and with anything that I talk to you about I back it up with facts. So I just actually wanted to introduce you to my trainer. So her name is Chris, she is American, she is absolutely incredible. So with Copilot you get assigned your expert personal trainer and I think that's what makes Copilot Fitness different. They basically give you the time to speak to your personal trainer, to build a relationship. You have such a human connection with them and they really understand who you are, you know, any niggles you might have, maybe any injuries you might have had and most importantly your goals and what you want to achieve. And basically they go away and they create a personalized and bespoke training regime for you. They even take into account, like Chris and I was talking about, really about my, my work life and how busy things are in my schedule. And one of the most important things I said about Copilot Fitness is that it has to fit in. I don't want to feel pressure or have to worry about something that I've got to fit it in at that specific time. It has got to work for me. And Copilot Fitness does. It is amazing. If I've got half an hour here, or if I've got an hour there, or 20 minutes, or 15 minutes you can literally speak to your trainer on a daily basis in the app on the chat on the chat section and literally I just chat to Chris and say what do I say so um, my workout felt great the third circuit was rather difficult um, we can actually reduce the rest time which for me <laughs> is quite something love the exercises but there are a lot of sets I'm sorry I didn't get to work out last night. I hit my head, fell, and hurt my elbow. Would it be possible to move my workout to tomorrow? And could you also maybe include exercises um, that I won't actually have to use my elbow? And Chris automatically came back to me and said, I think it's best you don't work out this evening. How about a soft, gentle stretch? And so she created a workout stretch regime for me. And it's so easy to follow. I'm always getting asked what I do in the gym. How do I stay so lean? How do I do my ab workouts? What workouts do I do? So I thought, why not come down to the gym? Why not do a workout with you so that you can see just how simple, easy, and I can't believe I'm about to say this word, but fun it is. They change it up, they mix it up, it's not boring. I personally find it not too difficult, but I can seriously feel it. It's not like one of those workouts where you are in excruciating pain at the time. No, I'm not in for that don't want that <laughs> but equally the next day you can most certainly feel it and I always have a little bit of a it's almost like the benchmark for me how painful is it to lower myself onto the loo I can't believe I just told you that but it's always that one where you know like the glutes and the thighs at the time it doesn't feel so painful but the next few days you're like oh I feel that and you know you did a proper workout so Let's do it together. Just getting my trainers on, and that's the best thing about this workout, is that I was talking to Chris and saying, look, it's really important that we adapt the workouts as to the equipment I have. And I think that's something that maybe you guys can take away with you. If you do have a gym membership, or you might have a treadmill, or a rowing machine, or potentially a bicycle, you can speak to your trainer and explain that, and they can develop the personalized workouts to the equipment that you have. But do not worry if you don't have any equipment, because in Mallorca, I don't. And I was able to say, you know, we actually have quite a large outdoor staircase, and I'm praying for sunshine. Pray, 
pray for me. <laughs> so I was actually saying I could use the staircase in Mallorca as, um, you know, equipment. Run up and down, jump jacks, go for a run. Obviously, I've got my mat out there. So Chris has actually designed a workout specifically for Mallorca. And that's just how personal it gets. So, I've got my trainers on. I'm probably going to whip off my cardigan because, oh, we're gonna get a bit of a sweat on. I'm going to put my hair up. Oh, and we are going to get started. So, let's turn the app on. And do you know what? I love the beginning. So, with this specific workout, because Chris knows I'm at home, I've got my two kg dumbbells and I'm gonna do a little bit of arms. So, I'm gonna show you the workout, just so that you can see what I'm talking about. So fingers crossed you can see that. And at the very top, you can see the equipment that I'm going to need. And then we've got our warm up. So, they've got the previews. So you've got cat cow, you've got body weight, seated hip rotation, you've got single arm and toe touch reaches, you've got march and jump jacks. Now, with a couple of these things, I actually, didn't know what they were and for me that's you know I would say that I am a bit of a drum gym bunny so the best thing about it is it literally has exact examples and it talks you through it so it shows the muscles that it's using and then you've got the example there so at the beginning let's do this it also counts down so you can see how much time you have left in your workout. So we are going to simply click start workout and here we go. Up first is 30 seconds of cat count. Press start to begin. Start. So that is Chris's voice. And then it counts me down. So I've got 25 seconds of the exercise. And hopefully you can see me. This is so lovely. It's just stretching my abs, rolling out my spine. 10 seconds left. And just getting me ready for my workout. Oh, divine. That's time. Up next is 30 seconds of body weight seated hip rotation. So I've now got rest. So it shows you the workout and then your rest time, which is the yellow Start at the, the top. Next set. So I should have started the next set. As you can see at the very top here, the blue is your workout time and then it will go yellow and tell you your rest time. And of course, we've got this little chip chappy down here showing us exactly what we need to be doing, what I should be doing, instead of yabbiting onto you. So meant to be starting the next set, but as you can see that gentleman going up and down and also sides, so you can see the way that his back and spine should be in the correct position. So, gosh, I'm out of breath.
So that is my co-pilot fitness workout done. It is quick, it's easy, it's effective. But what I love the most is that it is so personalized to me. I was literally going into depth with Chris saying, I'm getting on a plane, I want to feel as though I'm supple, I'm stretched, I'm not sort of gonna be too sore and crampy sitting on a plane for two hours and she's literally created the most perfect workout. One, to ensure that I feel it and it's actually doing something. Look, I don't wanna waste my time in the gym. I don't have the time. And so she has created something that is so bespoke to me. And so yeah, we just did that together. And also like, can we just, can we just have a moment here? Like, I don't think I've, really, I would say my wedding was the last time that I was in this kind of shape. And I've got to be really honest with you, I didn't do it in a healthy way back then. But with Copilot Fitness, I have literally achieved strength. I'm feeling healthy, I'm feeling fit. And do you know what? I actually really, really wanted to focus on feeling strong and it definitely comes to no surprise that actually on my left side, I was very weak and I, you know, it comes down to having major shoulder surgery and I felt like my right side was having to take the brunt of things, but the last couple of months with Copilot Fitness, we've been going from one strength to another. At the beginning, I found it quite difficult with the different reps, but with different exercises and sort of building it up slowly and to the point that I can cope with, I have literally not felt, or it's safe to say, looked much better. So I'm feeling extremely chuffed with myself in all honesty, but I'm so excited because I've managed to wangle you guys 14 days free using my code so i will leave the code on the screen now of course it will be in that juicy description box down below along with everything else you see in my youtube vlogs go and take a look go and read up on copilot fitness because don't just take my word for it i always always advise you go and look at the website go and read the about me page go and read the testimonials because not only me there are so many other other people out there that have had just the most positive experience and I just wanted to be able to come on and speak to you about it. I think our health and wellness is something that I most certainly take extremely seriously. And I want to, in some ways, encourage you. And it doesn't have to cost a fortune. You don't have to have a fancy gym. You know, you can see in the background, I've got a treadmill and a rowing machine and a peloton over there but I have quite literally just spent the entire time on the floor with a couple of weights and done the most remarkable workout to literally achieve like I go on about the the line and like I've actually got abs and I've had a fair few mini eggs today as well and you know what it's all about balance I want to be able to eat food I am such a foodie I don't want to starve I don't want to be on any silly diets and and I also don't want to have to worry about what my workout is going to be. Chris, my expert trainer, is on it. It's on the app. All I have to do is get myself in here, turn my app on, put my AirPods in, and get through that workout. And I feel so happy and I feel so healthy after doing it. So, as I said, I've managed to get you 14 days free with your own trainer using my link down below. So, sign up have fun enjoy it and i truly hope that you stay on this fitness journey with me so we've got a bit of a busy evening ahead of us we've got to pack we've got to prepare i was even thinking about washing the mop before we head out tomorrow morning we are leaving at the crack of dawn but we are going to the sunshine I am so excited. I cannot wait. I might even have to do a little bit of a workout when we get there. The sun rising, the sun setting, might even get mummy involved. The full shebang. So we need to head inside. We need to get packing. I need to go through a few bits and pieces, what I'm going to be taking. I will, of course, share that with you. I always seem to overpack and then I don't wear half the things I take. So I'm going to famous last words, try and travel light. 
Hold me to it, guys. It will be a miracle if I can do it, but I'm thinking whites, creams, I'm thinking linens, I'm thinking fresh, Easter vibes, the full shebang. Full shebang is gonna be gorgeous, it's gonna be delicious. So let's go and get started. Okay, so just finished dinner, had a very, very quick dinner. Quickly blitzed some vegetables up, had some couscous, and had like a picky bit dinner. You know what I mean when you're just like, you just cannot be bothered to cook, you've got loads of random things in the fridge and so you have like a bit of everything. That was dinner. That was dinner. And I didn't want to go to the supermarket because we're leaving, so I basically just cooked up all the random bits. Poor Mark. Um, he was like, what is this? I was like, that is your dinner. Enjoy. Bon appétit. <laughs> Put a bit of tzatziki on it and just fixes everything, doesn't it? Anyway, he's so organised, he's already packed and watching a movie. It's half past nine, so I really need to get a skedaddle on. And I have popped everything on the bed. It looks like an absolute bombsite down here. But I've got shoes down there. I've then got, like, outfits, a few dresses that I haven't quite made my mind up. Uh, Path my mother, jumpers, the Dyson. And then, basically, my idea is that we're just gonna, we're just gonna pop it all in the suitcase, gonna travel light because I never end up wearing everything. And then all I need to do is wash bags, makeup bag in the morning, along with adding the last little few bits and pieces that is chocolate, a few little prezzies for mom and dad, and mint sauce and red currant jelly. They just don't do it the same out in Mallorca. So without further ado, let's do this. So what I always do is I actually pop my all my shoes in shoe bags. So I'm actually going to be taking my Fairfax and Favour Regina's and Mark is such a diamond of a human being. He always polishes them within an inch of their lives. So they are heavily polished. So obviously I'm not taking any risks. And so I've always put my shoes in their shoe bags. I'm going light on shoes and I'm not taking one pair of heels. Can you believe it? Lena is me, not taking heels. I always take loads of heels and I never wear them. So we are going chilled this trip. We are going chilled. The only shoes I don't put in shoe bags are my espadrilles. I don't know why. I just feel like they're super clean and um, they like squidge up. They're perfect. Then what else should we put at the bottom? Let's pop my belts. Let's pop Mr. Dyson. And really, with the shoes, I kind of just fill all the gaps with things that can be sort of like squished down. So any undies, like if you're packing boots, for example, stuff your socks and your knickers into them. Or you can have a very jazzy little underwear bag. I think I've shown this to you before. My, um, I call her mummy Amanda, my mum's best friend Amanda, who is literally like my second mother, bought me this really quite a long time ago. It's like a little, it's got a little bikini on it. And basically I travel everywhere I go with all of my, don't need to show them to you, <laughs> my underwear in a very neat little bag like this. And it just means if ever my bag has to be opened, um, I haven't got a thumb on show. That would not be very good, would it? So, then I think I'm gonna do like workout wear. I'm taking a lot of workout wear. You heard it here. So, we are going to be running, we're gonna be hiking, we're gonna be doing our workouts with Chris on the Copilot Fitness app. I spoke to actually my mother just as I was cooking dinner. And I was saying to her, we are doing a workout together in the sunshine. And she is keen. So fingers crossed, once I get there, she's not had too many, too many margaritas. And we'll do a workout together, either tomorrow evening or potentially Wednesday morning. We will see how we feel. And my mum said, although it's beautiful during the day and it is currently sunny, it can get very chilly. Look at how beautiful this is. This is like my Halara tennis dress in navy. It's just so gorgeous. It's like a little cardigan. I think it's going to look so cute. So, all the things that can be squished is going on this side. My new contour uh, leggings or trousers from Holland Cooper. These are absolutely delicious. 
but like I was absolutely flabbergasted when they came. I was like, gosh, they look tiny. Anyway, pop them on and <laughs> these hold the bottom and thighs quite beautifully, if I may say so myself. These are in like a delicious, like dark olive green. And I'm thinking with my Regina boots and then like a fresh white shirt and then like my stunning Ralph Lauren um, green cashmere blazer because of the gold hardware on all of the Holland Cooper clothing, I think it's gonna look. Mm. Scrummy, absolutely beautiful. So we are actually going out for a few dinners um, as Mark's mother is joining us this weekend. I'm so excited, it's gonna be absolutely gorgeous. So we're gonna stay in for a few nights, we're gonna go out for a few nights, and we also just wanna show her like our favorite restaurants, a little bit of the island. It's so authentic. We're gonna be going to the Santeni market, but you guys will be seeing that on the next vlog, because otherwise I think this vlog might be a zillion years long. So all the jumpers are going in. I've gone quite heavy with the jumpers, but I feel like it's that weather. It's sweater weather, sweater weather. I will try and find that meme. Um, <laughs> those of you who understand what I'm saying, you get it. Those who don't think I'm crazy, which is fine. You know, better to be crazy than boring, I say. Right, that is all the tops in. A few little silk camis. Incredible basics, little silk cami. Sexy, cute, covers everything that needs to cover, and it's just a great base layer. Holland Cooper will, of course, link everything below. All my high-waisted trousers, whether they are trousers, silk, or jeans, we need them all, and they are all going in. Oh, this is fitting perfectly. I must say, I'm very impressed with my packing here this evening. Um, I do, however, need to get quite a large pile in for my mother. <sighs> right, that is off a dress, but I'm currently not quite sure where that dress is. Is this my dress? These are Molly's trousers. Oh, a little glittery Escada number. Those were the days. Okay, I think this is mine. Yes. Oh, I love this dress. So fresh, so gorgeous. This is a Piazza Castello number. You will be seeing that on me this week. Okay, then we're gonna go in with the summer dresses. I am hoping for sunshine. Gorgeous Goelia numbers. Got lemons and limes, loving the leaves, loving the yellows. And with these, I think I'm gonna take this belt off. It's gonna pack easier, isn't it? Oh gosh, what right down here? Oh gosh, maybe that doesn't come off. No, I think it does. Okay, right, that's gonna stay that side. Well, I suppose it means I'm not gonna lose the belts, doesn't it? So, Basically, my plan is, so I'm going to get all of this in. I've also got my travel outfit all laid out, ready to rock and roll. I travel, well, I like to say I travel in style, but comfort is key. Making sure you wear trousers that are loose, nothing's too tight. We're actually flying via Madrid because direct flights to Mallorca at the moment are like, you know what, they're not ideal in terms of like flight times and they are few and far between. So we are going via Madrid, which is fine. Which is fine. Oh my goodness me. I think I'm also going to make a protein shake before I head out tomorrow just because it's always so difficult to find like airport food that is not processed and that is healthy and fresh. I know that sounds so snobby, but I just think like, I'd rather not be left in the lurch and, and then be absolutely starving and eat something that I wouldn't normally ever eat. So I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do a protein smoothie tomorrow morning. I popped some bananas in the freezer yesterday. So I think I'm gonna use those. This is my nobody's child three piece suit. It's epic. So I will most certainly be taking that. A little Holland Cooper sweater, because it's sweater weather. Um, what else? I do also need to fit a wash bag in here, Leonora. Um, and I need to fit all the mint and mint sauce and red currant jelly. 
and golly, that is the most important thing. You know, we're having spring lamb on Sunday and they're all hoping we're going to bring the goods <laughs> from England. See, that is the big question. Are you a mint sauce kind of gal or are you a currant jelly? Mmm, big questions here. Right, these are not folded very well. Right, that is all of her stuff in. I feel like maybe I should just like bulk this side out a bit and then I can put my wash bag in this side. But wash bag in with cashmere, cashmere, slight worry. Okay, I think wash bag, I think wash bag should be all right in there. I think he'll tuck in there beautifully if you ask me. A few little headbands, always need hair accessories, jazz up any outfit or make any bad hair day into a good one. Then these were like maybes. My best friend's wardrobe from like three seasons ago. Yellow. How are we feeling with the yellow? I'm loving it. Absolutely loving it. And then we've got a few other little numbers. This is from, I believe this is like, yeah, Serafina. Beautiful brand. Needs a good iron, but it's classic and classy with a little pair of like navy Chanel pumps beautiful so i'm gonna spend a little bit of time pottering i need to do my wash bags i need to do my makeup bag i'm gonna sort of cull a little bit here pull my bag onto the floor and call it a night so i will see you guys very bright eyed and bushy tailed in the morning Here we go, going from the grey and miserable to the sunshine. Are you ready? Hello everybody. Hello everybody. Right, let's rock and roll.
morning my angels I'm sorry I'm gonna have to squint or hold my hand here but welcome to paradise home sweet home here in Mallorca with my family the Sun is shining it is the most beautiful morning a little bit chilly but that Sun is just setting my soul on fire we've just been for the most gorgeous walk through the mountains having a little look at those beautiful spring lambs they are just so so beautiful and I don't know what it is about this place it's just so magical and it's somewhere where I come where I can actually just take a deep breath and just really enjoy the real luxuries of life and that's just having slow mornings and sipping a cup of coffee in the sunshine listening to those cockerels and doing a gorgeous workout in the sunshine <laughs> instead of the rain. So I've actually managed to rope in Venera. I was hoping mummy was going to join me and do my workout this morning. However, she has a meeting this morning. So I'm just going to actually set up our yoga mats and we are going to quickly smash through a co-pilot fitness workout this morning. Anyway, I'm so glad that we're here and it's just going to be the most incredible Easter weekend with my family. But of course, that is going to be on the next vlog. We are going to be doing an updated garden tour. So much has happened. I can't even begin to tell you. Those of you, and there are literally thousands of you that adore gardens just as much as I do. And I have got a real treat in store for you. This garden will quite literally take your breath away and make you well up, so I cannot wait to share that with you. But anyway, without further ado, I'm going to go and get a glass of water, have a little sipette of coffee, go and grab a veneera, and we're going to do one of these quick, easy, but super effective workouts together. I've got a very special guest this morning. V is joining me for a workout in quite honestly, the most beautiful setting. I mean, as far as workouts go, I think this is up there, isn't it? Yeah, pretty much up there. So Chris has been very kind and she has set us up a full body weight circuit. Need no equipment at all. Um, maybe a wall to do the wall sit, but you don't actually need a wall. You can just hold it. So I'm literally simple as going to select start workout and off we go.
literally as simple as that I have submitted my workout oh and the sunshine is coming back out but I also just wanted to show you that you can actually sort of adapt it and change your workouts as to your progress and at the very beginning it kind of gives you when you've finished your workout just want to be able to show you guys as much as possible just so that you can get a real inkling yourself first of all just how easy the app is to use and just how bespoke Copilot Fitness is Chris my personal trainer has literally developed this whole workout to me and my abilities and actually one thing I really love me with the wind so after every single workout it gives you the option to kind of give feedback which I think is so important and at the very beginning I was sort of just popping things above just right maybe slightly too hard and I think it just goes to show how much these workouts are actually working and building strength because I would actually go as far as to say that it was just between too easy and just right and that just lets Chris know my personal trainer that she can step it up a notch so I'm gonna give the app five Five stars and I'm actually gonna give the workout four stars because it could have actually been slightly more difficult and I would never have said I wanted a difficult workout and I really really enjoy them which for me you know what I always found working out a bit boring but time-consuming and you know I only have so much time and I wanted to be able to fit something in that was quite difficult but super effective and co-pilot fitness have done just that so I am now going to submit my workout you can also pop in any any additional feedback should you wish to say maybe the push-ups were quite hard maybe you found a little bit of pain in your knees literally you can make it as tailor-made to you as you wish so submit workout and that is me enjoy done the rest of your day. enjoy the rest of your day that is me done so this week we've done two I've got another workout tomorrow because I know I can fit it within my schedule and then we are going into a very very busy wholesome and just divine Easter family weekend it is going to be so special and I just cannot wait so that there is my workout done as simple and as easy as that and I know I keep banging on about it but for me what makes Copilot Fitness different is having that really really personal relationship with Chris having a personal trainer that can come here there and everywhere with you literally through an app that is so tailor-made to me and my body and my metrics my height my weight it's even got like a profile picture I absolutely love it and I can speak to Chris every day I even sent her a message this morning saying hello from sunny Mallorca I'm gonna be working out today and tomorrow and then she has literally specifically tailor-made a workout using steps using a mat and literally all body weight which I love well first and foremost I need to build up strength in my shoulders after surgery and two I'd love to thin down slim down my thighs I want to make them strong but not bulky and yeah all of the workouts have just been fantastic and I've noticed a huge difference and so many of you have sent me the nicest messages to say that you know my health and fitness trajectory that I'm on it seems to be working I'm happy I'm healthy I'm working from the inside out and just want to be the very very best version of myself and I have been doing that with the support of Copilot Fitness so as I said at the very beginning I feel it's so important to be able to give you all the opportunity to do the same I, I feel so fortunate to be able to sit here and and work with and talk about these brands and use these brands myself but most importantly I want to be able to give you that opportunity so I have got a link I'll leave it on screen now but also it will be in that description box down below to give you guys 14 days free with your very own co-pilot fitness trainer your own personal trainer meet your trainers and I know that you guys are gonna fall in love with co-pilot just as much as I have so I truly hope you guys have enjoyed this one I don't know whether to give you guys a little bit of a sneak peek of the gardens as you can see the Sun is just beaming down and I'm just so happy to be here I just wrapped my arms around my mom and my dad last night and there is something just so special about family time and I, I can't wait to share it with you so why don't we we'll have a little bit of
of a mooch down at the bottom of the grand staircase and overlook the beautiful gardens because they are looking magnificent. I also need to retrieve my yoga mat <laughs> from down here. We were battling with the wind, but quite honestly, with that workout, I was really struggling with the push-ups. So um, it was quite nice to have a refreshing touch of wind, but let's head down here. I'm actually going to turn the camera around so that you can see just how stunning this is. Here we go. I am going to save the grand garden tour for the next vlog. That is going to be in my Mallorca Easter vlog. Gosh, how many Easter vlogs have we done at this point? It's been a bit of a marathon, but look at this. Look at the water. It is crystal blue. The jasmine is looking absolutely magnificent. The blue skies, the sunshine. Oh my giddy aunt, is this looking magical. I cannot wait to take you around and show you everything that we've done. Mark has been busy and they've actually been redoing all of the pathways with the stone and it's looking incredible. Truly, truly incredible. So I cannot wait to share that with you on the next vlog. So I'm very sadly going to have to bring this vlog to an end. It's been a bit of a health and wellness vlog, but I felt that it was about time that I, I shared it with you and that we can do this together in a way. And like I always say, my comments down below are always open. So let me know how you guys are getting on, whether this vlog was maybe just that extra little, little nudge that you needed to be the very best versions of yourself. And I'm just really excited to be on this journey with you. And of course, I love sharing my recipes or my culinary tips and tricks, but also life is about balance. And I think that is so important and you have to enjoy life. And I most certainly try to live kind of the 80, 20 rule where 80% of the time we are good and 20% of the time we are enjoying life, doing what you wanna do, eating what you want to eat, but also making sure that you follow that up with the 80% and making sure that you're working out in ways that suit you and suit your body to ensure that you are feeling and looking your very, very best. So as I said, I'm sadly gonna to have to bring this vlog to an end. It's been a bit of a different one, but I felt that it was just such an important one to share with you. And I cannot wait to see you on the next vlog. It is going to be the most happy, wholesome and heavenly weekend in the most magical place. And I cannot wait to share it with you. So I truly hope you guys have enjoyed this one and most importantly, sending you so much love.